It's hard to believe in 1979, you could go sit on Georgia 400 and not see a car for two hours. Look what it's done now. We're an economic engine. I mean, we have jobs. Charlotte could fit in our area between 285 and Windward. That is awesome. Our previous leaders in the community put the fiber optics in the ground, the power grid system, so that we could have these technology companies and have these data centers. Now with the addition of the new technical college, being focused on healthcare and technology, it's gonna help foster that environment even more. These companies wanna go where the talent is, and we have the educated talent that they're looking for when they're building and expanding their companies. Mercedes was a classic example. They were looking at a presence here in the metro area, and it's going to be in North Fulton, which is great for us. Well, I think our future is unlimited, and we have unlimited potential for growth in our business community. There's always something going on in one of our North Fulton cities. We have proximity to everything that a large city offers, but have a quiet um, lifestyle to raise your family. So it's a, a magnet. It's a magnet. People go out of their way to help you and to be a part of your life. You can always find a friend in North Fulton. And it feels like home. It's a place people want to be. The area is growing like crazy. Four years ago, when we signed the lease, we had no idea that Mercedes was going to move in as the crow flies a mile away from hammocks. Kind of worked out well. There's a lot of new development, a lot of uh, construction, apartments, homes, new business, things like that happening. As our customers complain about the potential traffic, I just got to say it's good for property values, it's good for our business. You know, ultimately it's a good thing. North Fulton is great. Priority started in 2005. You know, it's been 10 years and you know, now it's, it's like a different place. You know, there's always been a lot of business. There's always been a lot of really talented people. Um, we have employees from uh, Alpharetta and Roswell and Sandy Springs, Johns Creek, ton of, ton of talent that lives uh, outside the perimeter, north of the city. You know, something that's really special about North Fulton is a connectedness that maybe doesn't exist in other places. Uh, those are all part of being in North Fulton. You know, that makes life more enjoyable. That makes life more interesting. Instead of, you know, going to work and then driving home. Work, you spend a lot of time here, you might as well enjoy it. It really is a special place because you have a really nice mix of startups. You have a really nice mix of established companies. And I've, I've seen a lot of startups in the, in the area do that, where they've, they've scaled really efficiently in North Fulton, and we seem to do it pretty well. I've been here a little more than two and a half years. My family and I moved down here, and we were really welcomed by the greater North Fulton area. The climate that it has provided for my family in terms of educational choices, in terms of lifestyle choices, in terms of housing, have really been great. It's something that, that not just I enjoy from a business climate, but my family really likes being here. I take a, a lot of pride in the fact that whether I'm here at work Monday through Friday, I pass my building, I pass my facility every single day. I'm constantly around where I work. And that it gives me a lot of pride. The community gives me a lot of pride in, in, in what I do. It is a beautiful day in North Fulton. I have lived in North Fulton my entire life. It's been amazing to watch the growth of this area. It has been on a continual upward arc and uh, I have no reason not to believe that the future is not even better than today because it's always been that way. I was really impressed with how North Fulton County was such a big combination of great companies and, and a great community. I think there's got to be certain level of protection of, you know, who we are in each of our cities, but we cannot stop the economic development and the growth. 
you know, being in North Fulton, the projects that have started in, in the last you know, five years to bring more diverse group of people into our community have been outstanding. You know, so we've got a lot of development going on for downtown city centers. You know, that brings in talented people, right? Talented people need a habitat that they can live in that they love because work is part of their day. It's not their whole life. Part of retaining great talent and attracting great talent is that they can come to a place that's fun to live, that can enjoy their life. And so a lot of these, these projects have really been successful in being a catalyst to grow a lot of that diversity. People are, are gravitating to downtown. And again, since these city centers are providing these, these areas with fountain, five acre park where people can gather and listen to music and do food trucks, and people are, are, are really wanting that. They want to come back to the downtowns. They want to feel part of a community. They may go to Auburn, they may go to Alabama, they may go to Georgia, Georgia Tech, but we want them to come back here. And I think we can make it attractive for them to want to be here. I want our kids to be able to come back here and live, work, and play and have the quality of life that we have.